Hi my crafty friends, this is Scrappy Jess. I have a two part video here for you today. It's just kind of more of a sharing thing. So if you just like tutorials and you don't feel like listening to me ramble, no hard feelings. Um, I just wanted to let everyone know how much I appreciate you and how grateful I am. I received a ton of cards, beautiful cards, and letters and messages and emails and comments on my blog, and um, I haven't responded to all of them, but I am intensely grateful. It helped so much to get all of the feedback from everyone and to hear what you're going through and your struggles I know that I'm not alone and I'm grateful um we're doing terrific I think that we're back on track um David's supposed to be home very soon so I'm just getting back in the mood to do my crafting and ready to just continue on with everything and I guess kind of to kick that off, today in the mail, Provo Craft sent me all wrapped up. I don't know if it was an accident. Um, I called customer service when I got it in the mail because I didn't order it. And they're not really sure why I got it. But I love it. They could not have chosen a better cartridge for me. So I'm hoping that, I don't know. I, I hope that it didn't accidentally come to me. And I just kind of wanted to share some of the handbook with you. I'm not going to go through the whole thing. But there are a couple projects in here that I can't wait to do. There's a milk carton that just looks like a ton of fun. There um, is a word book. I am a lazy crafter, so... Honestly, probably I wouldn't make my own workbooks, but I might just do this. Um, you just you can change the patterns and colors however you want, and I think that it looks like fun. There are icons, a lot of really pretty icons and things, and then the papers are just gorgeous. I know when the Imagine came out, everyone was concerned about whether or not I would print vibrant colors. And this is printed. This is one of the patterns. Let me find the pattern that it is. Chinese dolls, really pretty pinks. Isn't that gorgeous? I love that. I can't wait to make a page out of that. I think this one's really pretty too. It's a bright pink. Green and blue. Oh, there. This is this pattern printed on the Imagine on white American Crafts cardstock and this is bright. It came out so pretty. I'm still running off of my original ink. I haven't replaced anything. Um, and I did take a hiatus so probably I'm not running. I, I probably would have had to change it by now. But I made 30 plus birthday invitations. I've made all kinds of projects and it's still printing vibrant full colors. So I'm really impressed with how long the ink lasts. I'm really happy with it. There's that cartridge. Um, thank you Provocraft if it was on purpose. Thank you if it was on accident. Thanks for letting me keep it. Um, this is the birthday card that I made using this. This is the, the background paper. Um, birthday wishes is, I just printed it using the print only feature at two inches and I changed the colors around. It's actually pink in the handbook and I love that you have that option to make it pretty much any way you want to. And then the cake is from the yummy cartridge and I just changed the color of the plate to a dark blue so that it would match my image and there's glossy accents on the candles. I turned off my borders. I wish that I had thought about this before or I don't know maybe I didn't realize that I could but there's no border on it because I turned off the borders and I think that that's gorgeous 
and let's see. I don't know, I printed something else. I'd have to look around. I printed something after this to see if it was a fluke. Oh, I think you know that I can't show you because it's got details on it that I don't want out. But um, I printed a thank you note, so it's not an accident. If you turn off your borders under the settings, you don't have a border on your images. And that's really neat. I wish I had done that before. I need to do a video on it. But anyway, thank you for your support. Thank you for being my friends. Thank you for still stopping by my blog after four months of me not really posting anything and I promise that I'm back and I'm going to start keeping up with my crafts again and thank you. Alright, you guys have a great weekend and I'll check, check back in on Monday. Bye.